Hey, what's up everybody? It's your girl, Philly Girl 31, and welcome back to another video. Hey, y'all see this box? Yes, your girl finally got her hands on the goods, okay? <laughs> but before we jump into the little box of goodies, make sure you like, comment, share, and subscribe to the channel. I am on the road to 1,500 subscribers, so if you're watching, kindly hit that subscribe button for your girl. To all my day ones, thank you for always returning to the channel and continuing to rock out with little old me. <laughs> all right, guys. So this haul is going to be the infamous, and I mean infamous, Bath & Body Works Everyday Luxuries Collection Fine Fragrance Smith Edition. There's 10 fine fragrance mists in the collection. I'm going to give them to you right now. First, I'm going to break the video up because this can be a long video. I do want to do the, give you all of the fine fragrance mists first. The next couple of videos will be me comparing the fine fragrance mist to the actual perfume that it is either inspired by or a dupe of so we can have some fun. <laughs> and I have all of the perfumes that they are speaking of except for two. I'm not gonna tell you which two I don't have or do have the other eight. I need you guys to stay locked in. So make sure the post notifications are on. That way you, yeah you, get alerted when I drop videos about it, okay? <laughs> Up first we have Oh Cherry. Oh Cherry, Oh Cherry, Oh Cherry. Oh, Cherry's fragrance notes are Black Cherry, Sheer Magnolia, and Tonka Bean. Yes, this is supposed to be a dupe for Tom Ford, Lost Cherry. Um, should I go ahead and smell them with you guys? Let's see. Let's just give it a whiff. I'm not going to give you my opinion of what it smells like. I'm just going to spray it. Because this will be all day if I do. Oh, yeah. If you like that deep cherry scent, it's not too sweet. This is more of a tart cherry. You are going to enjoy that fragrance there. Pink Obsessed. Pink Obsessed. Pink Obsessed fragrance notes are Blushing Jasmine, Cashmere Praline, and Vanilla Bourbon. This is supposed to be a dupe for or inspired by Valentino Born in Roma. Yes, guys, yes. <laughs> mm. Oh yeah, this one right here brings all the boys to the yard, okay? You want your man to do whatever you say, wear this around him. He'll be lost in your spell. Petal Parade. Oh, yeah. For all those bougie girls out there, Petal Parade. <laughs> Petal Parade's fragrance notes are Neroli Petals, Orange Flower, and White Woods. This is supposed to be a dupe for Carolina Herrera, Good Girl, or, or N Prada Paradox. Oh, yes. Bath and Body Works, y'all did y'all thing on this collection. I just want to tell you right now, like, if you like perfumes, if you're a collector of perfumes, you're going to love this collection. This collection has something for everyone in this collection. Up next, we have Getaway Soiree. Getaway Soiree fragrance notes are Sun Kissed Mandarin, Tuberose, and Solar Musk. This is supposed to be a dupe or inspired by Tom Ford's Soleil Blanc, as well as Replica's Beach Walk. Oh. Mmm. Yes. I'm ready for the summer when I put my hands on that. <laughs> Covered in Roses. Covered in Roses, guys. The fragrance notes in this one are Ruby Berries, Sugar Rosebuds, and Blush Amber. This is supposed to be inspired by or a dupe of 
Perfumes de Marley Delina. So if you don't own any of these perfumes and you do go out and you get your hands on these fine fragrance mists, you are winning, okay? These fine fragrance mists have a different formula because they are actually designed for great coverage. I mean, when I tell you great, they have some lasting power, okay? Oh yeah. They are stronger, they last longer. I'm here for it. Viva Vanilla, shout out to my girl, Viva La Morena, here on YouTube, what's up girl? I know she got her hands on this. If you guys haven't watched her video, go ahead and check her out. In the comment section in her video, make sure you let her know Philly Girl 31 told you to say hey, sent you her away. <laughs> so yeah, shout out to you, boo. All right, Viva Vanilla. Fragrance notes are rich plum, glowing amber, and addictive vanilla. This is supposed to be a dupe for Billie Eilish Eilish and Vanilla Vice by Sniff. Oh yeah. Mm. This right here puts Vanilla Bean Noel, Vanilla Bean, like all those fragrances that Bath and Body Works have already created that have vanilla in it. This one right here is number one for the vanillas. We have On the Horizon for all you aquatic girls and guys out there, yes. This one is definitely unisex, so the fellas can wear it, the girls can wear it. On the Horizons fragrance notes are watery bergamot, lotus blossom, and driftwood musk. That driftwood musk makes it more masculine, but it still has a feminine note to it. This is supposed to be a dupe for Replica's Sailing Day. Oh yeah. Ooh. I am here for this. Okay. <laughs> we have If You Musk. Yes, If You Musk. Now, I like musk, okay? And you know Bath & Body Works created a fragrance that was just musk number three. So, then they give us a If You Musk. If You Musk fragrance notes are Iris, Pink Pepper, and Airy Musk. This is supposed to be a dupe for Glossier U. It's okay guys, we only have two more after this. And I am definitely using these little test strips because it's so many of the fragrances here that I don't wanna mix the fragrances together. Oh yeah. This one is more of a soft musk. It's not one of those uh, really strong forwardy musky type scents that one's more on the softer side floral fantasy and i just care to say yes for the colors of the packaging they did their big one fragrance notes on floral fantasy are peach osmo uh, excuse me peach osmathis jasmine and warm patchouli this is supposed to be a fragrance dupe for Victor and Raw Flower Bomb. Remember that song Wale did back in the day for Flower Bomb? And everybody went out and brought this perfume <laughs> just because they wanted to smell like what he wanted. Let me know in the comments down below that you do that because I did, okay? Oh yeah. This for y'all sexy girls out there. Yes. And last but not least, we have Lost in Santal. Fragrance notes in Lost in Santel are Warm Cardamom, Satin Sandalwood, and Cedar Wood. This is supposed to be a dupe for Le Labo Santel 33. I apologize if I'm not saying these names correctly, but your girl has a twang, so it is what it is. All right, this is more of your earthy scent right here. Whew, we did it, y'all. <laughs> and under 10 minutes. All right, guys. I don't want to hold y'all. This is part one. Stay tuned for the next editions. We're going to break these down one by one. All right, guys. I love you, and I'll see you in the next video coming soon. Peace.